What's up guys, welcome back to another episode of Satisfactory Update 7. This is episode 55. And yes, I've known. I know it's been a while since I've released the video, just been dealing with some stuff IRL and uh, streaming and stuff. Uh, hope you guys enjoyed this series so far. We're gonna hop back in it. Hopefully I can get an uh, episode out every week now for you guys. Hopefully. Uh, yeah, so let's get into this episode. Uh, not sure what I'm doing yet. I would have to go back to the main hub to just jump off. I'm gonna go back to the main hub to get some, um, put something to research. I just came down here to uh, get some fuel. Now, why the game all of a sudden we came loud as shit? Alright, as I was saying, the, so we're going to the hub here, let's see what we can research. For this auto safe to go. Some parts, we don't necessarily need them, so I always my resources on them even though we can do that very easily. We have blueprints that we can unlock. Mm, no. We just have later date. We can go for sheets. Do I know that? No, I don't have that process now. So we can go for the um, The Mark 5, which I need aluminum sheets stuff. Smart suit, I need the that helped me with uh, uranium because I did find uranium a couple. Episodes ago. So. Yep, radioactive. So I could go for this. I. 50 filters. I don't have that being made right now. That's the only thing that I don't have automated the filters. Seems like it's fibers and rubber, rubber fiber and, and um, coal. This one unlocks the drones. Uh, the thing that we don't have automated here would be the sheets. We have the motors, we have the um, aluminum casings, but we don't have the aluminum sheets. Same thing, we don't have the aluminum sheets. Seems that aluminum sheets are one of the stuff that we need to automate right now. Uh, no one have anything to do with uranium at this point. We do have nuclear power here, but we need super computers, which I don't think we have. Advanced aluminum system. Ooh. This one unlocks some more aluminum stuff. 
Read my notes. I need that to actually get that post no doors for the um is for. I don't know if I thought this stuff. This is actually created in the this I don't think. Yeah. Yeah. So I need to even get this unlocked, I need to unlock this. Get this unlocked. I need. I do have three D controls. You know, I need to get these shots. Nuclear power. I need to get uh, supercomputers. How do we make supercomputers? I don't even think I have that. Oh. There it is. So for the supercomputers, I need sheets also. So. In order for me to even get down the uh, tech tree to unlock a nuclear power, I need to automate the production of aluminum sheets. I do have aluminum casings, which means I may have to ramp up the flow of that aluminum factory to produce some way more um, aluminum that, that it is producing right now. So this as our goal. Uh, we have radio control units already. So what we're gonna do is start automating aluminum sheets. Which is basically just copper uh, copper ingots and aluminum ingots. I think a couple of ingots very easy. Aluminum ingots is the tough one because it has to go through two arm um, refiners and a forge. That's a tough one to get. A little aluminum factory that we built last two episodes we used to Check it. As you can see here on the roof, this is where the um, no, remote control units, radio control units, whatever, is being produced in these two manufacturers. Have some. There's a fifth day for the research. Uh, the casing should be downstairs. Stay. I don't have any in storage. That's because I'm not producing them as fast as I'm using them. But yeah. The reason I'm not producing them as fast is because the ingots are lacking. The reason the ingots are lacking is because the silica down here, from these guys, I think, these guys are not producing enough silica. I may need to ramp up this section here, but just break down that wall and go straight through. That's an option. I spent the whole episode setting up this wall. Margin. Now I may need to do a couple of uh, calculations to see what's the optimal. Production of these guys. So how much I need of these guys. Because I have enough for the. For those. Two to produce the. Uh, the sheets. 
but maybe optimal for the save file. So how much save file is this which is per minute? 50 per minute, right. So that's 50 per minute times 3, that's 150 per minute. I'm currently producing. Uh, so that's 150 per minute. We have to go upstairs again. Let's see. I'll put Rose there. So 150 per minute is what we're currently producing. How much are we using? How much we are using? So three of these. So these are using 75 per minute. 75 by 3, that is. Not. Come on. What by 3? By 2. Okay. Where was that? 3. Sometimes by 2, that's 150. Um, yeah, 150. I'm right. So it's. So these are using the same, um, it's using the amount of producing. So we have no extra to even do anything with. So if we want to be producing more silica than in, that's not one for three. I see. Uh, let me calculate that my phone if I break my number in. It's 75 by 2. Yeah, it's 150, that's correct. What the frick? <laughs> yeah, so it's 150. So if those are producing 150 per minute, and these are using 150 per minute, they produce four each. How much 60 per minute each producing? I don't know. Uh, So 60 times 2, that's 120. I oh. don't know. Yeah, that's 120. Uh, so these are virtually 120 per minute. But this side here, I am using 60 per minute times 3. Here, I'm using that at a rate of. 6 trees are 18, that's 180 per minute. So I need more of these. Supply that. But if I add to this, I'd okay. also need. Huh? Pick up, um, that. That ah. Yeah. Um, so if I upgrade this, that means this will go from 150 to. 25 by 3. Mm. Second. And 25. So I will go up to 225 and need 225 still couple minutes. I think I already have enough aluminum. So, we need to get 225. You know what? I think I'm just going to double the amount and sort of going through the whole calculation and trying to even it out. I think I'm for the bottom here. It's running currently at its optimal for two. I think I'm just going to double, bring this out a bit, double the amount of um, refineries we have here. So, for the first stage. So we have three, so we're gonna have six. I may have to double the those there, but that would come out next time. Um, let's just put the photo. Get to the end, right? Well, we got there. Um, there's no century route to those. Uh, so we need three refineries. Let's get that one. Uh, Set up in our to do list three refineries. 
have to collect some stuff. And come back. So we have to go get some more industrial and case beams, some more sheet steel pipes. I said sheet pipes, that's good. Some more steel pipes and some more motors and couple. So as we're here already, we're gonna go up to the Oh yeah, we can get steel pipes down here. Because there is steel pipes going into the um couple factory. Yeah. So the only thing that I need to go down to the steel factory for is for the steel um uh, in case industrial brims. So it's sketchy. Right, so Motors here. Let's grab some motors off of this toilet here. Get some motors done. Uh, these steel pipes. Stay still. You know, stick them from there. Uh, what do we need other than that? Down here, a couple of sheets. Yes. Sheets. Uh. Steel pipes, I'm gonna get that when I'm on my way down. Because there's a truck station that drops for steel pipes up there. Let's switch back to the right over. Let's drop down here. There it is. Some steel pipes, now we have to take the hyper chip connection down to the steel factory to get the uh, in case of industrial beams, which is on the third floor. Steel factory. Been in this building in five. It's only two floor. Up four flights of stairs. So that would be made by these guys. They're locking concrete. That's where. Everything for those. Where that do that um see stuff is locked in concrete upstairs. But I'm not interested. Some talk to be upgraded. Not two mines. Uh, so I don't know, man. I'm already up here. Let me just jump into one by the um, explosive factory. Right, there should be one there. Let's jump in that one. And 
Right, so... We have everything here. Uh, let's head back down to that factory. Still need to get a copper across there so that we can... Make bees a copper... Um, because it's so many nearby. I think I remember there was... There was iron or copper that I saw. A little ways down from the front of that factory, on the other side. Can't remember. Some something else. Might be iron. We'd have to go check after we make this slight expansion. Weird, but it's temporary. It's better here. Oh, 
Now you can see we have some silica going upstairs because these guys are finally using from the um, liquid. Uh, next episode, guys, we are going to ramp up this side of the production, even though we don't currently need it. Because these guys, I think, are out holy crap 300 and 60 per minute so i don't even think we need two that's the thing i don't even think wait we don't even need two i didn't know these guys put out so much holy freaking hell 260 per minute what the hell okay we don't need two of these bye bye That's why our storage has been full so fast. We do not need two of those. At all. And that's good enough. Holy shit. So now this is not gonna fill up anymore it should just continuously pull from this guy so he's not gonna be full and once he's not full he's gonna pull the this liquid off of the pipes so that these guys can continuously empty themselves if that makes sense uh, just for the heck of it let's put a uh, I don't know if I'm mark two, I don't. Okay. The mark one pump here. Make sure that these this all the liquid from this section is going that way and not backflowing. What I have to do is to just pump everything back up to where it was. Is I'm gonna have to empty the full pipeline of this liquid. There's a bit of gap there for it to fill back up. As you can see, it's now using these guys down here. Which should ramp up the production of my silica. Two. So if it was 150 before, I remember the calculations, it was 150 before. 50, but yeah, 150 before, now it should be 300. 300 per minute. which coincides with the just a little less than the amount that one of this produces, which is 260. Didn't know that one produced that much. Very why our storage was full. Still full. Oh, 
Let me see, why are these guys on idle right now? Water. Infamous waters. How much water does these guys take in? 18 cubic meters. 18 by 6. That's a hell of a number. And we need to upgrade the... Oh yeah, I have to upgrade these pipes, I just remembered. Because the flow rate is um not as much. Anyway guys, hope you guys enjoyed this episode. Uh, let me just up outside here to get a thumbnail. I hope you guys enjoyed this episode. If you guys want to see more satisfactory on the channel, don't forget to drop a like, hit that subscribe. Also, my live streams. I have four live streams per week. Mondays, Wednesdays, Fridays, and Saturdays. At 7 p.m. EST. If I am canceling a live stream, I'd usually let you guys know on Twitter. Or X as it's now known. Oh god, that was a lag. Okay. okay. I thought I would have been a perfect position, but I guess not. While I'm on my way to look for an area to take a thumbnail. Sec. Uh, as usual, the unedited version of this video is going to be available for all patrons. And uh, it's also Alright, so it's gonna be unedited for the Patreons and you guys may get it a bit earlier than the rest of the YouTube audience. Now oh. Okay, so that should be a good thumbnail. That's a weird expansion, but oh well. Okay, so what we're gonna do is thumbnail time. I right, guys hope you guys enjoyed it. See you guys in the next one.